Hello again. Today we'll be looking at the Integral 256 gigabyte Ultima Pro memory card. Now, 256 gigabytes for under 30 pounds is a pretty good deal. It says it does 4K and of course it will do 1080p and everything else. Now if you have a look at the top here, you've got the V30 symbol and then you've got the 3U and it says it will do 100 megabytes write, sorry read and 90 megabytes write. I'll be checking that out in a few minutes. But let's open this up. Now the reviews on Amazon were not over favorable for this. Some people said that it was a fake. Um, but I'll test it out for you, let you know if it is or not. Okay, so we've got the memory card and then we've got the adapter that comes with it as well. I'll test out that as well to check to see if it's causing the problems that people are having on the internet. So as you can see there, it all looks okay. And if you have a look at the printing, the printing is nice and clean. Usually with the fake cards, you'll see that the printing is very smudged and dirty looking. Uh, this one is nice and clean and crisp, so I can't see any problems with that so far. But I'll put it through the tester now and see what we get. Right, so this is using my memory card adapter. We've got 78.8 write and 90.8 on the read speed. If you look over to the top right hand, uh, in the green section, top right hand, you'll see that we've got 1080p coming in at 80 write speed and 4k at 20. So 4k is it's okay, so you could use this memory card in things like drones, um, GoPro, things like that would be quite fine. If you're using it in a camera, then maybe I should, I'd find a, a faster 4K write speed. But it's okay for smaller cameras and drones. Music players, phones, things like that, no problem. Right, I'm just putting it through again using the original SD card adapter that came with the memory card just to see if there's a difference because there were a few people saying that this card was not performing correctly. But so far it looks to be giving the same results as the card reader I used. Yeah, it's pretty much the same. You got 18 on the write speed for 4K. So maybe it's a slightly less quality SD card reader. But definitely not the results that people were saying. So it's not a fake card at all. Uh, it seems to be working pretty good. I'll put the max content on and I'm sure it'll be fine. If any problems, I'll let you know, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.